Hello out there in the interwebs. You have your tunes tuned. Blah, 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 blah. Words are hard. <laughs> anyway, you have your tubes tuned to Kendall Bruni, and I am uh, a little bit south of Concord. Yep. Just a little way south of the museum, if you're in, just basically followed the road there. Uh, which. Actually, this is another mod that I have installed. I didn't even. <laughs> I've been playing with it for so long and never. I didn't, didn't even remember that it was part of it. But all these uh, roads and stuff. Those are from a, I think it's literally just improved map or something like that. It's really nice to be able to have all these roads. Uh, anyway, um, I mentioned that we're going to do stuff with Preston, and we might not get to that today, because something that we have not discovered quite yet is a shop. And we're actually looking at two shops right now, uh, but the first one is right here. Huh? This is Trash Can Carla. So what's your story? Looking to trade? Rob me? Or just ask directions to Diamond City? Um, just looking to trade. Let's see what you've got. Oh, I have a little bit of everything. This is Trash Can Carla. She is a junk dealer. She has, she basically sells a little bit of everything. Um, and I don't have an incredible amount of money right now. But you can buy just about anything that you would want, you can get from her. Uh, is there anything particularly interesting that she has right now? I'm not seeing... Any well, she's got some oil, which is always nice to have, but that is way too expensive. Uh, screws are also one that are very nice to have, but are also very expensive. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Nope, nothing really worth buying from her, but, more importantly, you can sell to her. Uh, mine and knuckles, and yes, I'm going to sell the minigun because I don't really care for many guns. Sell, sell, sell. Pipe pistols. Rifle, more pipe pistols. Rifle, pool cue. Do I want to keep the laser musket? Mm. No, it's really heavy. <laughs> it's really heavy. I uh, don't need that. And don't need that. I don't have to use the cryo later. Pretty heavy. And, oh, cool. I have a whole bunch of stuff from the uh, Raiders to sell there, too. I'll uh, keep that, sell the gas mask, the harnesses, definitely. Uh, I'm keeping most of the leather type things, because leather is kind of difficult to uh, get your hands on, at least without scrapping uh, armors and stuff. Sell those, sell that, because um, one of my favorite utility mods for uh, armor and stuff is pocketed and deep pocketed. Oh, I need to go repair that. Um, and to have pocketed and deep pocketed, you need a bit of leather. So, go ahead and confirm that trade with her. And then right down the road here is the Drumlin Diner. And you can find Trash Can Carla. She, I think she's from Bunker Hill. But she, for my games, she always goes to Sanctuary City and just stays there. So, hey, it's it's a good it's it's a pretty good. Uh, Starting store. Is there someone out there? All right, good. Good, good, we good. We had a deal, Trudy. And that makes me want to save. There Hand we go. Hand over the goods you owe us. I ain't giving you poison shilling chem pushers anything. Where's you my? Know what uh, that there they are. Done to my boy. He bought them fair and square, Trudy. Ain't our fault if he's strung out. Whoa, mm -hmm. whoa, easy there, scaver. This doesn't involve you. <laughs> Oh? You stop waving that gun in my face, or it's gonna involve me. Okay, okay, just take it easy. There you go. We'll lower our weapons, all right? Just don't do anything crazy. What's going on? What's going on here? That's a simple business dispute, got it? Trudy's sitting on a pile of goods that she owes me. I tried reasoning with her, but it looks like I gotta take what's mine by force. Wanna make some easy money? Help me out. <laughs> I could use another <laughs> gun. Or maybe you think you can talk some sense into her. Um, there we go. I'll talk to her. I didn't maybe even realize it, but I think I'm out. actually was actually looking at uh, three stores. If things go sideways, we'll back you up. So, um, started order up. Just a, it's a really quick little quest too. Hello. Hey. Excuse me. I saw you in that poison cellar talking. Well, he ain't getting his money. Period. <laughs> Look, you owe the money. 
If you just pay them, then this will be over. Everyone walks away without getting hurt. All right. Yay, okay. for being charismatic. But that bastard ain't gonna sell one more drop of jet to my boy. That's you right. That, Wolfgang? You'll get your damn money, but I better not catch you selling chems to my boy again. Fine by me, Trudy. <laughs> your son's broke as shit anyhow. All right. Crisis is over. If you're here to trade, step up to the counter. Trudy is much like Trash Can Carla in that she sells just about everything. Um, and she'll buy just about everything, too. She She's probably my go-to store for... Well, she's definitely my go-to store for the beginning bit of the game, at least until I get to Diamond City. Um, and then Wolfgang here, uh, <clears throat> he sells chems and stuff. And I don't even gotta shoot nobody. Good job. Here. Now how about I show you all the pick-me-ups I have to offer? Uh, sure, let's take a look. Yay, leveled up again! Nice, 200 experience sure. for that. let's take a look. I got stuff that'll blow your mind. What all do you sell? Because he, the I've never actually <laughs> I don't usually do stuff with the chem dealers because I don't do very many chems in this game, uh, but some chems that are very nice, uh, Radex, Radaway, and Stimpaks. Those are all very very nice to have, uh, and if you're not too worried about the uh, addictions and stuff, things like Jet can be a huge boon. Um, Psycho buff out, Mentats, all kinds of different things. Uh, you can get some really nice bonuses from chems, actually, in this game. Uh, but I'm not going to... Because I don't really need to... How's my inventory weight doing? Could be better. Uh, oh, I... I'm going to go ahead and sell some of these shotguns to her. Get out of the way, dog meat! Hey, We're open Trudy. for business again. A little lighter in the pocket, thanks to you. Sorry. How about you buy something and make it up to us? I can do that. Let's see what you have. It's all worth every cap I'm charging. Alrighty, uh, ooh, 10 millimeter rounds. That's a lot of 10 millimeter rounds, too. I will go ahead and take that. Uh, but I also want to sell my extra shotguns because they're shotguns, but uh, I only need one, really. Do I have. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm not selling them to your boy, I'm selling them to you. That's fine, right? Right? I should also put these melons and carrots and stuff away. Um, <laughs> so yeah, there's a lot of good stuff you can... Uh, sugar bombs. Why don't I pick those up? Anyway. Alright. So I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, lighten my load a little bit. And then I think I'm going to... I don't remember how I can take pressure along with me or not right now. But uh, I'll go ahead and figure that out. And I'll be back in a moment, little viewers. And I am back, little viewers, and I've done a couple of things. Um, one, I went ahead and upgraded my... Oh, hit the right buttons. There we go. Went ahead and upgraded my 10mm. Uh, it now does 27 damage instead of 18 damage, so that's nice. And that used up pretty much all of the uh, useful scrap that I had on me. <laughs> I also went ahead and leveled up, uh, got myself some sneakiness, and traded in dog meat for Codsworth. Hello, Lucy. I'm over here at the Abernathy Farms, which... Ba -ba 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 -ba, you know, just uh, south of the Red Rocket. If you're actually at the Red Rocket, you can see the icon for Abernathy Farm from it. So you can just follow it to uh, this place. And it's a pretty nice uh, little farm. I want to talk to you. Hello? Hey there. That's close enough, stranger. We're a peaceful farm. We don't want any trouble. That's okay. It's okay. I'm friendly. Not looking to cause any trouble. Oh yeah, trouble. and I went ahead and put on my uh, vault suit. Warned. We're <laughs> out here, so don't try anything. Let me tell you, farming ain't easy. Out in the field all day, every day, and every minute of it spent watching your back. <laughs> Farming's hard, hard work. work. Won't argue with that, Blake Abernathy been ages since I've seen one of those vault suits around. You new to these parts? <laughs> yes and no. Yes and no. <laughs> it's a long story. Either way, good to see a new face. Mm -hmm. How about you? Ever think about working the land? I could never settle down that uh, <laughs> that long. <laughs> never really thought about it. <laughs> Don't know. 
Never really thought about it. Hell, neither did I. I was born into it. Word of advice, though. If you do start up a farm, be ready to deal with the raiders. Why do all the so hard work when you can here? just take what you well, want? Well, if you've got anything point. worth so trading, it, huh? you can talk to me. I don't know what happened there. Oh. There's... They're all over me. Something going on outside? Why don't you people just take leave cover. us alone? Someone's shooting at him. What's going on? There they are. Hey! None of that. I'm gonna shoot you. Yeah, that's right. In your face. All the blood. Was that the only one? Where's the body? Where's the body? Where's the loot? The loot's on the body, but where's the body? Man, where's the body? Where'd it go? You guys didn't disintegrate it, right? You're just using regular old bullets. Wait, do you see it, Codsworth? I don't see it. Didn't look like that raider had very much on him anyway. Uh, well, anyway. Before we were so rudely interrupted, let's go back and talk to uh, Blake some more. Because he has a thing he would like us to do. There we go. Right. So, where were we? Come on, talk. Please talk. Excuse me. There we go. Let me tell you, farming ain't easy. Out in the field all day, every day, and every minute of it. Sure. Uh, looks like I'm going to have to go well, back through it. You Blake Abney. We'll just go yes. ahead and uh, way, skip through this quickly. How about you? Right. Uh, I don't know. Don't know. Hell, neither did I. Word of advice, though. Why do mm -hmm. all the hot work? Uh, yeah, Raiders, uh, we just dealt with one. <laughs> Sounds like bad news to me. You really are new to these parts. <laughs> Best armed bastards in the Commonwealth. Raiders? <laughs> you have no. something they want? They won't hesitate to take it. Last time those Raiders hit us, my daughter Mary tried to stand up to them. Uh -huh. Now she's buried out back of the house. Only 21 so, yeah, years it's old. It's understandable that Blake has a, a, a low That's opinion of Raiders. Men back. And the sooner... The better. Mm -mm -mm. Preston Garvey's crew? Minute so man. you know him then. You mean Preston Garvey's crew? Any idea Garvey's why they haven't been around so much lately? Um, not sure. Uh, we'll go with the nice one. Most gave their lives to protect the Commonwealth. That's a damn shame. Those were brave men and women. They'd been here when those raiders hit us. My daughter Mary might still be alive. I don't have much to offer, mm -hmm, but mm -hmm. those raiders that killed Mary, they took her locket, too. It's been in Connie's family for generations. Mm. If you could get it back, it'd mean a lot to us. I can do that. Don't worry. I'll get that locket back for you. Good. Connie feels like it's a part of Mary. I don't think she'll rest easy again as long as it's gone. Alright, see, I came over here because they want me to go to um, a specific place and, and get the thing from the raiders, and I'm pretty sure these guys here also want me to go over here and deal with those raiders. So, uh, I'm going to go ahead and cut out here and wander over there, because I don't think there's going to be too much interesting between here and there. Uh, if there is, I'll go ahead and bring you back. So I will catch you in a moment. And I'm back, little viewers, because... Look! A legendary rad roach! <laughs> Die, you roach! Boom! <laughs> so yes, when you're playing on... Um, on survival mode, you get a lot more legendaries. And I didn't think they showed up until, uh, until you were level 10. But... Um, I would appear to be wrong. What do you got on you? A staggering 10 millimeter pistol. That's interesting. I might play around with that. Go ahead and take those. Um, so yeah, that was really all I wanted to show you. Uh, first legendary. Alright, and I will be back in a moment. And I am back once more, and here we are at uh, 10 Pines 
thing. I forget the <laughs> I already forget the name. And yep, the journey was pretty uneventful. <coughs> now just go ahead and kick uh kick her awake and be like, Hey, you needed help? I'm help. I can do help. I can do what it do nine times. We don't need any more trouble around here. I'm not trouble. I'm with the Minutemen. It's okay. I'm with the Minutemen. I'm here to help. You're Heck with yeah. the Minutemen? I didn't really think you fellas still existed. We sent word with one of them passing traders, <laughs> but honestly, I never expected anything to come of it. Most people don't put much stock in the Minutemen these days. Well, quick. now stuff is coming of it, so Bad what can I help you with? That. Ah. We're rebuilding the Minutemen from the ground up. Heck yeah, we are. We're the good guys again. Glad to hear Yes, it. we are. No question that things have been worse since the Minutemen fell to pieces. <sighs> There's a Excuse me, little viewers. Been giving us trouble for weeks, stealing food and supplies, threatening to kill us all if we don't pony up. I can do that. We know that. where they're coming from, but we can't go up against a gang like that. Sure, I can. Uh, Walden Pond? Dang. I was hoping it'd be, uh... Don't worry. It'd be a different I'll place. take care of those raiders for you. Thanks, friend. If you <laughs> folks are for real this time, it'll be a welcome change for the better. Alright, Walden Pond. I'm not sure I've ever actually been to Walden Pond before. Um, data, data, data. That one. Walden Pond. Where... Where are they? Okay. They're way... <laughs> they're way over there. I think... I think the first time I ever played this game, they were just right there at uh, Olivia. Uh, but they're, right now, they're over there at Walden Pond. So, <laughs> I think I might. I think I may. I don't know. I'm gonna figure. I'll probably go ahead and do uh, Satellite Station Olivia first, which is probably not gonna be all that interesting. At least you know me actually going in there. Um, I might show off the place a little bit. So. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and head over there, and I'll come back once I'm over there. So, back in a second. And I'm back, little viewers, and I just wanted to show you this. Boom. Headshot. <laughs> but, gotta be careful about these mall rats, because of that one. <laughs> yeah, I think uh, that one with the mines on it. Yes, and those were mines on that uh, on that mole rat. Um, I believe that one might have been trained by the raiders. Uh, go away. Yes, take that. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I'm pretty sure that one mole rat uh, was trained by the raiders. Because it killed me, uh, little viewers, while I was off camera. Because I was like, eh, I don't think this place is going to be all that interesting f uh, for, like, on camera stuffs. I'll just go ahead and go in here and, nope, oh, I got blowed up. <laughs> also, I did manage to get a, uh, I got another, uh, legendary fight. This time it was a dog, and I got a. Nailed it. I uh, got a, um,. Quick draw 10 millimeter pistol. So that's cool. Let's go ahead and get the caps lock back off. And yeah, doing caps lock is important if you're going to be a sneaky character. Um, at least until you hit uh, level 23, I think it is. Might be 26. And you can take the uh, perk that lets you move around at full speed and still be able to be sneaky. And if you're going to be a sneaky type character, that one's pretty important if you don't want to be crawling around everywhere. Alright, so, yes, this is uh, Station Olivia, which is where the raiders that killed Blake Abernathy's girl uh, are hanging out. So, we're going to see about killing the crap out of them. And for the most part, it's a fairly straightforward affair in here. Do I want to get their stuff? No, not really. The heck? Oh. Codsworth uh, seems to have found some bloat flies. Where are they? Uh, Codsworth, what are you doing? <laughs> Tis but a scratch. That's awesome, Codsworth. I've never heard him say that one before. Uh, hooray for Monty Python references. 
Cosworth is apparently the Black Knight. Let's grab the jet and the lighter. Rubbish. Lighters are always good to pick up, loyal viewers, because they have just a little bit of oil in them. And you're going to need oil for doing a whole bunch of different upgrades and such. So, um, duck, there we are. Most of the area in here is pretty uneventful. I mean, there's a whole bunch of raiders. Um, Sir, do proceed carefully here. <laughs> I, I find this place unsettling. That is fair enough, Codsworth, because there's a laser trip right here. We'll snag that, and then, I believe it's on the roof. It's on the roof. Right there's a Tesla arc. And it doesn't take any kind of skill to be able to disarm those. So, so that's nice. Uh, I find this level of darkness entirely unnecessary. Well, I like this level of darkness, Codsworth, because I do my best work in the dark. And I believe, yep, I just got uh, the perk to be able to handle these guys. Let's see, denies, nope, D-E-N-I-E-S, possibly. There we go. Nailed it. I'll just open the intel room. I'm probably not going to do any, um, like, read any of the uh, terminals for you guys. Just because, I don't know, when, whenever I watch someone and they read the terminals, I never find it all that interesting. But if you want me to do, to read them anyway, uh, leave a whoop. What? Oops. <laughs> you didn't see anything. Come back out here so I can shoot you in the face. <laughs> oh man. Oh. Doge. Bam. Splat. Yep, he definitely knows I'm here now. <laughs> um, ah, I blew my. That blew my train of thought. Mm, nothing there now. What do you well, think? You guys done? Jumping in shadows. Yeah. yeah. There's someone out there. Oh, yeah. Um, most yeah. of these raiders are not very threatening. Now, but, huh? but there is one. Who is very dangerous? Um, she's down at the bottom. Uh, she's got a minigun. No sign of him now. <laughs> so, yeah, you run into her. You're gonna want to make sure that you're ready for her. Get out of the way, Codsworth. Jeez. years ago, I never would have thought this level of dust possible. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, cut here, and I think we'll come back to. Probably the raider with the minigun. So, oh, what do we got in here? Anything really cool? Mm, nope, nothing really cool, but I'll go ahead and take all that stuff anyway. I'll take the coffee cup, too. Alright, so, I'll be back in a moment, little viewers. Ooh, duct tape. Hey. Oh, and I'm back, little viewers. End of the uh oh. Take long. <laughs> hey, don't beat up my robot. Um, now I'm gonna save my crit. <laughs> Because we're down here at the bottom. Um, uh, well, yeah, it's. I and I came back because this is the big. <laughs> this is the big fight in this area, at least. And did I get two of them? I think I did. Nope, I did not. There we go. Ow! 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 ow. Uh, yeah. Ack! Ack! Um. Oh. See. <laughs> See, that's what I was saying. Um, Ak Ak, that's the leader of the raiders down here. Uh, that's the one you're going to want to be careful about because, as you saw, uh, she just kind of tore me apart. <laughs> and I blame Codsworth for this one. <laughs> yep, 100% Codsworth's fault. 100%, because he just kind of wandered out there. <laughs> Hopefully, he won't do that this time. Uh, and if I have to do this. Uh, more times. I'm probably... That's not what I want. That's what I want. If I have to do it uh, more than just this turn here, I'll probably... Hey. be doing it uh, off camera. Codsworth! Well, that doesn't bode well, does it? Raider! Shoot you! Fail, fail! Nailed it! There we are. There's Akak. I'll just go ahead and take my crit. Thank you. And... 
Đây 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 đây. Um, please hit. Hit her once. Hit her again. Get her, Codsworth. Huzzah! Victory, victory for us. Even though she took down Codsworth, but that's okay. Codsworth will come back. Uh, some people, I've heard, they don't really like that you know your companions are essential. But considering the AI is dumb as bricks, uh, I don't mind that all of my companions are essential. Uh, it means that, you know, I don't have to rage quit about them charging someone with a minigun and then die. <laughs> Alright, so, um, you get down here, basically I think where I left, last left off, you just, let's turn off caps lock, you go around the corner, and then you come into this room, and I go through that door, because, well, there's usually a guy or two over here that you can deal with before having to deal with everybody else in here. And the other thing of uh, interest in here is Fusion Core. <laughs> Alright, let's head back in here because the actual reason we came here is to get that locket. And that locket is right over here in this locket. Let's go ahead and take, uh, yeah, all that. Alright, so <laughs> I'm probably going to go ahead and cut here. Do you want this stupid minigun? Eh, I can carry it. Might as well. Uh, so, I think I'm going to go ahead and cut here. And... I think we'll come back to giving the Abernathys uh, the thing they wanted. And that'll probably be it for the episode. I'll check the recording time. I would not believe how this place sets off my cleaning senses. <laughs> uh, so, I'll catch you in a moment, little viewers. And I am back, little viewers, and you asked me if I had any luck finding that locket. I've got that locket back for I you. I sure do. You serious? Oh, yeah, That's you get some caps, news. too. Caps are always nice to have. He's gonna be speechless. Yay. I'm sure she'll go lean on her prices after what you've done. Mm, and level. feel free to use our workshop. Ooh, look at Waste that. Experience go. Whew, look at it go. Awesome. All right. So, uh, now that after helping them, you... Do you need to hold it? There we go. Uh you basically get the Abernathys, and they're pretty cool. They have a whole boatload of uh, potatoes, which I feel Seems like it's a mix between well. a tomato and a potato. And since they don't mind, I am, yes, I am going to take every single one of them, because potatoes plus corn plus mute fruit equals vegetable starch. And vegetable starch equals five adhesive low of yours. Uh, that's one of the biggest reasons uh, if you want to just, you know, min-max it. It's one of the biggest uh, reasons to um, do settlements and stuff. Because adhesive is a real limiting I factor for most stuff. <laughs> low of yours. Thank you, Lucy. Um, let's, let's see, what's our level? Uh, we could get more sneaky, where we won't set off any more traps. Uh, what else could we do? Uh, we should probably do armor. Uh, ooh, or we can do locksmith. I'm going to go ahead and do locksmith, because I like being able to get into everything. And you can technically, well, you can obviously get through the game without a uh, locksmith or hacker. Um, you can technically get through the game... Uh, and open everything by only having one of them, but that requires you carry around a specific uh, follower, one for lockpicking, there's also one for hacking. Uh, you could even get away with having neither of them, and you know just switch back and forth between those two companions, but that's a lot of walking back and forth. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Alright, so I think there was something else I was going to do? I don't think I can manage anything right now, though. Um, it was... Ah, oh yes. going to show off. Um, let's go ahead and pop on over to the uh, Red Rocket. Because there's one other mod that I'm going to just... Uh, just talk about briefly for a second here. Because it's... Um, it's a really cool mod. It is... Legendary Modification is the name of the mod. And much like it sounds, it lets you... Add legendary stuff to a... Uh, your things. And you might be going, what? 
I thought you were trying to be like balanced and stuff. You're playing on most dif the hardest difficulty, and you're gonna just make all your stuff legendary. Uh, well, the thing is, do 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 do. Oh yeah, I picked up a mighty laser musket, which is actually kind of tempting to use. <laughs> I've got to say. Uh, but I'm not going to because I just don't really like laser muskets, little viewers. It's really slow to fire, and in a normal fight, I have I have terrible aim. So if you go ahead and you hit, you hit scrap on your legendary things. Um, you'll see this effect chip. You need effect chips to be able to uh, put legendary stuff onto things. So, for example, let's just go down here to do 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 where it says no legendary. Um, you also have to be a certain level to be able to get legendary effects. Uh, like right now, you see, I need uh, I would need three to make it no legendary, which is I feel like that's a bug, but either way. Um, yes, you have to be at a, um, you learn, you just get new legendary recipes as you get higher and higher level. Um, so it's not like, you know, be level one and be able to put, um, two shot on one of your things. There's also, if we go ahead and just open this up, go all the way over to crafting. I think it's all the way at the end, too. Um... That's not it. Not the weapons workbench. Power armor, power armor, power armor. Cooking, cooking, cooking. Codsworth. There it is. The 2LM work workbench. That is two legendary modifiers workbench. Um, and as you can see, it takes a pretty good amount of stuff, actually. And that lets you basically craft things that have two legendary modifier slots. Um... Which it's still at least if you do if you um, install the survival version because there's a whole bunch of different versions of it. There there basically is a version that's yay I'm gonna have all my stuff be legendary and then there's also uh, the survival uh, version of it which if you want to have all your stuff double legendary you've got to work for it little viewers. Um, I've actually doing a playthrough I'm almost level 30 now and really only now am I able to start uh, making use of the chips and making my own things and that's not even I have a full set of things it's I made a single thing <laughs> so that's going to do it for this episode little viewers what have we done uh, we piled around the Codsworth and we helped some uh, people out and next time Next time we're probably going to go and uh, do, 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 beat up on these guys down here for these guys up here. So until then, I shall catch you on the flip side. Laters.